TV. I'm Aryan. I'm on it. And that's the shot in the back. And today we have another vlog for you guys. We're going to another location to do some amazing filming and talk to a very interesting person. This car, you're, you won't even believe it. So let's go. All right. So like I said, we're going to a really special place. So here's that place. We're currently at the coolest garage I've ever been to in my life. So let's check out some of these cars. So here's the first one here. This is a McLaren 600 LT, a insane track car. One of the coolest McLarens you can buy in the market right now. It's in an amazing white color. I love those papaya orange brake calipers. It's, this is definitely one of the coolest cars that I've ever seen in my life, but the cars here just keep getting cooler because right behind me over here, we have a custom Lamborghini Urus. Honestly, the race tires are amazing. This blue paint is crazy. And this is just, <laughs> I can't believe I'm here right now, honestly. Right here, we have an Aston Martin Vantage. This one has the Mercedes AMG engine actually because Aston Martin has that new partnership with AMG. So it's a really cool collaboration between both companies. Here's the Aston Martin Vantage from the front. But honestly, this is just, okay. I feel like I don't sound that excited, but I'm freaking out right now. Right here, we have an Audi RS6 Avant. This one's in hatchback and it's honestly pretty rare. We don't really see too many of these RS6 Avants on the road, but it's absolutely beautiful. And my favorite part about this car, look at those rims. They're absolutely beautiful. And that red brake caliper, just the overall combination that this car has is amazing. Here, we got a Lamborghini Huracan Performante and it's absolutely beautiful. It has a beautiful black color on it. It is wrapped and some lovely gold wheels. You can't see the Italian flag because of the wrap. Today is Halloween and obviously for Halloween, you definitely gotta get a pumpkin colored car. This is not just any pumpkin colored car, this is a McLaren Senna. And it's crazy. The size of this wing is absolutely huge. If you see my hand right here and you see the rest of the wing, it's absolutely crazy and it's super high too. The car is incredibly low. Like I'm just barely kneeling on the ground right now and it's just at my height. One of my favorite parts of this exhaust, I'll probably show you some sound clips of it later because we will be driving it. Well, not me, but obviously the owner, but honestly, yeah, it's yeah. definitely one of the coolest cars here. Very, very track capable car. And you guys know the pricing of this car. It's in the million dollar range. It is the craziest car ever. It's Jeremy Clarkson said this is the car that out P1 is the P1. It, it's absolutely fantastic. All right, we're gonna do a quick walk around of the Senna. So here we have it. It's absolutely beautiful. There's glass everywhere and it's crazy. Here's the front. Honestly, it's so beautiful, that orange color. This is a special edition Senna, number three of 500, and it's absolutely beautiful. Here we have a Lamborghini Aventador, but not just any Lamborghini Aventador. This one is an SVJ. The master of the Nürburgring, currently holding the Nürburgring record. It is one of the fastest Lamborghinis you can get, and it's crazy. Once again, another huge carbon fiber wing here, and guess what? This crazy orange color, it looks like a wrap, right? It's totally not a wrap. This is completely stocked with the car. I guess when you buy a high profile car like a Lamborghini, they let you to be pretty free with the colors. Also, here's the shot taking photos. So in case any of you guys have ever wanted to see the inside of a Lamborghini SVJ, here we go. This interior is absolutely beautiful. This Aventador SVJ actually has the exact same spec as the one when it was released in the Geneva Auto Show. It's absolutely beautiful. Those amazing column mounted paddle shifters and probably the coolest interior of a car I've seen in all probably ever, but that might be changed. Here, back with this Performante. One thing that's really cool I notice, this one actually has the forged carbon fiber here, and it's not a really usual thing you'll see, usually like with the Senna and the uh, Aventador, you're gonna see the standard carbon fiber, but this has that special forged carbon fiber package which has these larger chunks of carbon fiber. I know it's a really small thing to notice, but honestly, with all these cars here, it's kind of cool to point out some of the smaller things. Now, the 600 LT isn't the coolest car here. Somehow I'm saying that because, I mean, you've seen the other cars here, but uh, it's definitely a very cool car. The 600 LT is very unique. It's based off that 570S platform. And on, honestly, it's an amazing track car. It's a, also a great budget track car. I mean, look, there's nothing budget about a McLaren. It's obviously way more than 200,000, but still, it is an amazing car for what it gives you. All right, we're gonna do some photography with the Senna, but to do that, we first gotta move the 600 LT and the Vantage out of the way, so let's do it. All right, we've driven out a little bit just to get this photo shoot done, and there you go. There's the Senna. It's looking absolutely beautiful. I mean, in this orange color, it looks amazing, especially in this lighting with these beautiful fall colors. This is the best looking car I've seen in my life. I'm a big fan of the color orange. You guys know me. I'm a huge fan of McLaren Formula One. And this color, this color on this car, it's absolutely amazing. There's, I'm speechless right now.
All right, guys, we just got back from the McLaren Senna shoot and with all those other hybrid cars, it wasn't even just the McLaren Senna, which I'm still just stunned by. That was a crazy opportunity. I am super stoked that I was even possible. Probably one of the best days of my life to just have that full experience. Huge thanks to Rick. None of this would have been possible without him. I mean, that was just such an amazing perspective to get and just being able to photograph all those cars, being around and really seeing what it's like to own a car that caliber, it was just crazy and I can't wait to do something like that again. But for now, that's all we have for today. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. You can check out the full version of our audio podcast. The link for that will be in the description and stay tuned for more car culture. Thank you. Bye.